Hey guys, it me, Laura. Okay. Hi. It has been a while since we've done one of these because as you recall, we have changed the unboxings to fort monthly. So I do them every two months. So this unboxing is for June and July. I have a heap of stuff. I got back from Peru a week and a day ago and I'm straight back into uni and work. I had my birthday and it's just been madness. So I'm kind of a bit sick and I'm just getting over it now. This is a race against time. We are racing before the sun goes down completely and I have zero lighting. So fingers crossed we can get through this but if the lighting changes it's called the earth rotates around the sun. That's what it happened. Let's do this. First thing is from No Sender. Look at this little puppy, I wanna die. Hi Laura, I'm a big fan and figured you would need a patch or two for Punk Harley. I found this one and loved it, thought you would too. From one Harley cosplayer to another, thanks for being you. From Emily. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Emily. Here is the awesome patch. That is so badass. That will be perfect for Punk Harley. I've kind of put Punk Harley on hold at the moment, but I'll get around to it. Thank you so much, Emily, for the card and the amazing patch. Next thing is assuming it's from Michael V. I'm assuming. I'm just guessing. Yes. I always know it's Michael because he always says howdy at the beginning. Howdy, Laura. A book you might be interested in from Michael V. Ooh. The story of music, how music has shaped civilization. 40,000 years of music from prehistoric instruments to modern day pop songs. Oh my gosh, yes, this is music teacher, like, this is the stuff. Michael, thank you so much for this. This is gonna be an awesome read and maybe a potential resource for my teaching. Next thing is from No Sender. You guys really don't want me to know who you are. <laughs> Hey Laura, my name is Jamie, aka Builder Boy. I just wanted to say you're doing great and don't be discouraged by anything. I love you, mate. Oh, love you, mate. I love your demeanor and I love your pirate cat word. And you might be interested in hearing that I'm finishing my own pirate Robin cosplay. That's so good to hear. Lastly, I want to say I'd love to see you make an April O'Neil cosplay. I just feel it's something you could have fun with. Goodbye, end vlog from Jamie. Jamie, thank you so much for your kind letter and your kind words. Good luck with your pirate Robin cosplay. Next thing is something I received a while ago at Sydney Comic Con. This is from Tim's Corner. He watches my vlogs. Hey Laura, first off, how are you? And you're awesome. First off, I'm great and I know. I've been a fan of your work for over a year now and I can't get enough. You may not know, but you've helped me a lot in the last few months because I myself have been going through a breakup and even before that, life was hard. There have been times where I just wanted to end my life completely, but you've taught me that the best thing in life is to have fun being who you are and who you want to be. Tim, I just wanted to say I'm so glad that you are here with us and that is the whole thing of life. It's crazy, it's a roller coaster. You have like these crazy highs and then you can come down really really low and you just don't you just want to get off the roller coaster so to speak so I'm glad you're still on the roller coaster because it's gonna keep going up and then you're gonna have those ups and downs and I'm glad I could help you through your doubt growing up I used to dress up as Ash from Pokemon and every Mufti day I got picked on because of it plus I got picked on mostly because of my disability kids are cruel they really are when you're younger I used to get bullied a lot for my weight and my geekiness and just general being. I'm so glad that you're not being bullied anymore and that you're stronger because of it. Meeting you has to be one of the most exciting times of my life before it was meeting the hosts from Cheese TV. Oh my gosh, I'm right up there with Cheese TV. You've inspired me to cosplay a character you can relate to. That's why I was Peter Parker and at the moment I'm working on my own spin-off as the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. I hope I get to see you again soon. Keep up the awesome work. Yours truly, Tim's Corner. Oh, Tim, thank you so much for your kind letter and I'm glad that everything is well and I'm sure I will see you at Sydney Comic Con, maybe. Next thing is from Stephen. Oh my gosh, we have a return to sender name and address. I'm not gonna stalk you, but it's good to, to yeah. 
Oh, from Stephen with the broken foot at Supernova. So I met this gentleman on the Saturday of Sydney Supernova and he had a very badly broken foot, like it was in one of those massive boots. And he was super lovely. He came up for a photo and said hi. He has given me this really cool Joker apron. It's gonna match my lipstick. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. Oh yeah, awesome. Oh my gosh, Stephen, thank you. This is the bee's knees. Yeah. Oh, that is sick. I love it. I love it so much. Thank you. And hopefully I get to see you at Sydney Comic Con as well. Next thing is from Tat. Tat has sent stuff in before. She's from Brazil. She is awesome. I picked this up before I even went to Peru. So it's been a long time coming for me to open this. All right. Oh, wow. There is a whole collection of things in here. Okay, where's the letter? Where's the letter? Here it is. Hey, Laura, how's it going? Not bad, thanks. Tat, how are you? How, how are you? How are you going? It's been a while since I sent you a parcel and that makes me a horrible follow-up. I don't understand that sentence. You're not a horrible follower for not sending stuff in. You can just literally follow me and that's all you need to do. You don't need to like anything. You don't need to buy anything from my Etsy store. You don't need to send me anything. Just being there is a fun time, okay? It occurred to me that you're about to come to Latina America for the second time. Yay! But unfortunately, Brazil is off your tour again. That's a pity. It's true, that is a pity. I really wanna to go to Brazil so bad. Hopefully they can invite me to a convention. Since you couldn't pay a visit to us, maybe Brazil should go to you. So in this box, you'll find only Brazilian stuff. <gasps> in matter of fact, you'll find your best goodies, but to be honest, some of them are not my favorite. You have to try it, right? Oh my gosh, is that mean there's food, Tat? Is there food in here? Here's a spoiler of what you're about to find in this box. Diamante Negro is a 100% milk chocolate with little pieces of cocoa and chocolate inside, like little diamonds. Where is this? Where is the chocolate? Oh, I found the chocolate. This is by far my favorite one. I have to confess, this is not a fitness chocolate at all, but if you're looking for a fitness one, you should go to item number two. No, we're not doing fitness today. We're having a break and we're gonna try this. Oh. Okay, here's the chocolate, guys. Oh, yum. That is good. Mmm. It's a bit crunchy and there's a lot of it. That's what I like about it the most. Chocolate's cacao show. I have to be honest about this one. I don't like it at all, but they are fitness. A 100% fitness bar. They are made with cacao and are a little bit bitter. Oh my gosh, I'm just really happy there's food. That's just a random bag. This is what they do when they bleach my hair. Oh great, good stuff. I got a letter from the Australian Border Force and it was open for inspection and no items were removed, so nothing will be missing. Thank you, Australian Border Patrol. This is the one, I'm assuming. Let me read the, oh my gosh, it's only got 13 grams of carbs. Of course it's the fitness one. I should probably take this random bag off my head. Don't worry, I'm gonna eat this all over a course of a week. I'm just having a little nibble to show you how my reaction is. This is a big one. This is like a, a rock, like a chocolate rock. Oh, mmm. Tap, you might not like it, but guess who does? I love it. This is really yummy. It's like got dates in it. It's like a chocolate date cake. Oh, yum. Okay, I really don't want to butcher the pronunciation of this. I'm just going to try my best. Peo de mel con dolce de lait. In a free translation means honey bread and it's very yummy. I don't know how to explain it, but it is so good. It's like our equivalent of Vegemite. So does that mean it tastes terrible? Because <laughs> that's Vegemite. We eat it for breakfast. You probably already noticed, but in America Latina, we eat sweet things in breakfast and I don't know why. It's true. You guys have jam everywhere. If you have breakfast in South America, there is like a massive bowl of strawberry jam on every single table. It blows my mind. There's sugar everywhere. Oh no, I'm forced to eat sugary things. Terrible. What if I ate the bread? What if I got it confused? What if that was the bread that I thought it was? Where's my bread? Guys, I got it wrong. I ate the bread. I didn't eat the fitness bar. You know that meme with that lady and she's trying to like calculate stuff? That's me right now. I, I 
I've done stuffed up. I figured it out. These little chocolates, these are the fitness ones. I ate the non-fitness one. That stuff is amazing. The honey bread that I just ate, that I stuffed up, I got it wrong, I flipped them around, is the best thing ever. And I'll be finishing that soon. So yes, I really like the honey bread. Now I've got a selection of different types of healthy chocolate here. I'm going to straight up try what I'm assuming is the most bitter, which is 85% cacao. I'm just gonna dive in the deep end. Here we go. It's very dark. Mmm. Mmm. It tastes like if you had hot chocolate mix and you just ate the hot chocolate mix with no water in it. And I really like it. I actually like it. In conclusion, the honey bread is the best thing that's ever happened to the world. Mate Leo. I really butchered the pronunciation. I'm so sorry. I'm not going to try and translate it because it might be a little awkward, but it's a typical Brazilian black tea. P.S. You should freeze it for about an hour before you drink it. I know you said I should freeze it, but I'm going to have a sneaky sip now and then freeze it after. This is like a soft drink pretending to be healthy. It is like full of sugar. I love it. I love it. I'm not gonna sleep tonight. This is great. But Tom, another not healthy chocolate, but it tastes so good. I love this one. According to Tat, it's the bee's knees. It looks like this. And I'm going to open it now for a sneaky, oh my gosh, they've got a really cool packaging system here. <gasps> Whoa, you open it and then it like, comes out it's like a bullet canister or something that is so cool oh my gosh it's literally like a stick of chocolate oh wow that's good it's got like milk chocolate inside can you guys send me more food please like this is really wow official brazil shirt the last item is more like a gift from Brazil. I hope you like to have our official shirt. Oh yeah, this is cool. This is awesome. I love it. I have a trumpet student, Lucas, who's half Brazilian and he's obsessed with soccer. Maybe I should wear it to tutoring and he'll just go nuts. Tat, thank you so much for my amazing parcel full of amazing food and this shirt and I really love learning about other countries and your culture and everything you guys have to offer. It's so cool. Next thing is from... Oh, it's all the way over here. Unknown sender. Woo! There is a lot of stuff in here. Okay, where's the letter? Here it is. Laura. Oh yeah, it's a lion. I love lions so much. Like a lot. In case you didn't know that, I really appreciate that. To Laura, hope you're going great. Love the Pankali cosplay and cannot wait for what's to come. I've been meaning to give these to you and I hope you like them. Hashtag spoilers, you and Ellen look great, obviously. Such a great duo cosplay. <gasps> Thank you so much. One of the best cosplayers out there and hopefully I'll see you in Melbourne at another convention if you make it down. Best wishes, Claire, AKA Belle. Claire Bear! Oh my gosh, thank you so much for this. I really, really hope to make it down to a Melbourne convention again soon. I haven't seen you in a while, girlfriend, and I miss you. Oh my goodness. First of all, Disney princess wrapping paper. Hello. Second of all, there are like four things I need to unbox. I have my beach joker and beach Harley that Claire gave me when I was in Melbourne Comic Con last year. Oh! <gasps> It's Ellen! It's animated Poison Ivy, which is what Ellen cosplayed at Melbourne Comic Con last year. <gasps> oh my gosh, these are so going on my shelf. I'm assuming there are more pops. Oh! oh my gosh, thank you so much. This is the official Punk Harley Quinn that they released and everyone has been tagging me in it, but I haven't actually gotten around to purchasing it. But now I have it as part of my pop collection. Claire, thank you. Oh, yes, my boy, Negan, thank you. I love him so much, so much. Oh yeah, it's me, it's me. Me 
and Ellen. Oh, that's the best. Claire, thank you so much for these amazing pops and I hope to see you again soon. So Tim, who sent the letter before, he sent this through and it's the gold medal Harley. It is amazing. Thank you. I'm gonna pop that next to my Christmas Harley. Next thing. See, this is time sensitive. The sun is going down, the earth is rotating, and time is happening. If time could stop, that would be great. I know this human being. This is Kevin from Canada, and he's the most amazing artist. Can we just appreciate the Canadian stamp? Is like the best stamp I've ever seen. <gasps> this is special. Oh, wow. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, Kevin! This is amazing! Happy birthday, Leo Laura. Love, Kevin. <gasps> This is incredible. You've done it again. Wow. Oh, this is beautiful. I need to get it out of the... <gasps> this is so great. Oh my goodness. Look at me. Wow. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, wow. Kevin, thank you so much for this amazing artwork and thank you so much for the birthday wishes. Big love and hugs for you all the way from Australia to Canada. Next thing is from unknown sender but how cool is this packaging oh my goodness we have peacock feathers and butterflies here people it is beautiful what what this is so cool guys this is really really cool before i show you what it is this is their instagram tag the laceration they have done a really cool caricature of me as clubbing harley and me as classic harley but taped to an actual Harley comic. That is fantastic. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Thank you so much for this incredible work. It is amazing. I really appreciate it. And this is super talented, awesome. You're fantastic, thank you. Next and final thing is from the lovely Xander and Cassandra. They are Geek Heart AU on Instagram and they are amazing. I ran into Cassie at Supernova just recently and Xander couldn't make it, but hopefully I see him at Comic-Con. And they sent this express for my birthday. <gasps> I received it on my birthday, but I thought I would open it here so that you could see my reaction and stuff. Okay, let's go. Oh, wow. Everything is so nicely wrapped. I don't know where to begin. Oh my goodness, there's so much stuff, guys. I'm spoiled. To Laura, happy birthday. You do you. So, so beautifully. From Cassandra and Xander. Oh, guys, thank you so much. Thanks again for always making Xander's day and for just being you. You are an amazing role model. Wishing you endless and epic birthday wishes. Guys, this is so sweet. Thank you so much for my lovely letter. Can't wait to see Xander again at Comic-Con. It's been a while. When I ran into Cassandra at Supernova, she had a photo for me to sign for Xander, so I signed that for him, and he has returned the favor and signed a photo that he took of me, and that is pretty special. That is going on my wall. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. It's bubble wrapped. <gasps> I think. Oh. Stop. I don't know what to do with myself. It's a burger mug. I just need to process this information because this is amazing. Wow, Xander, Cassie, thank you so much. I love it. This is this is the mug. This is my mug. This is my mug. This I'm never gonna use another mug again. Ooh. Oh, a thermos, yes! Oh, with the Harry Potter Hogwarts logo on it. Oh, fantastic, thank you. I definitely need one of these because I've got a tea addiction, as you know. I'm addicted to tea. This will be fantastic for uni, thank you. Ooh, stop it. It's a Harley Quinn stubby holder. That is really cool. That is so cool. Oh, oh my gosh, Steve sunglasses. Get out of town, I'm putting them on immediately. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> on your Steve, these are so cool. Wow, thank you so much. I'm gonna leave them up on my head. It's a burger. Oh my gosh, yes. Thank you. Oh, so I can carry him with me and then I can have a little burger nap. Oh, sick. I am so using this. This is one of those pop sockets. Those pop sockets that you put on the back of your phone, but it's daddy's little monster. It's like Harley. Oh, I love it. Thank you. Oh, oh, oh. 
Stop. Get out of town. Burger, fries, and soft drink erasers. I will definitely be using these. Is this? Stop. I, 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 I don't have words for how cool this is. This is another pillow. It's fries. I've got burger and fries, guys. I've got burger and fries. This is so cool. Thank you. This is awesome. Kawaii. I love it. Thank you. Oh, Steve tea lights. That is awesome. That is so, 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 so cool. Oh my God, I have a massive collection of stuff, guys. Thank you so much for your very, very generous birthday gift. I'm very excited to see you both again and it's gonna be awesome. Guys, thank you so much for this really generous and amazing unboxing. I'm utterly spoilt and very, very blessed to have such amazing, kind fans, and I'm glad I can share these experiences with you and open this stuff. I still have about three more travel vlogs I need to edit from Peru, and I also have two convention vlogs that I did at Peru. So I vlogged the Friday, the Saturday, and unfortunately I didn't get around to vlogging Sunday as Daddy's Little Monster because it was intense. But I do have some footage I will share with you guys. So that is going to be the content on this channel for a little while longer. And yeah, as always, thank you so much for watching this video. You are all amazing. I love you all so much. Have an internet hug. And I will see you in the next video. Mwah. Where is that cake? Testing. Many. Well done, Laura. I'm panicking because I'm overwhelmed. I am overwhelmed. I'm having so much fun. This is fantastic. Oh my gosh, my camera battery. What am I doing? I'm just eating chocolate. This is. Whoa. Are we filming? Yes, we are. Ha ha. La 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 la. Watch this. I just don't care anymore. <laughs> I said I know. I just forgot. I'm not a criminal. Okay. Eh. I need to go back to the gym. Maybe I just stop wearing pants so then they don't get tighter. Mmm. That's right. That's called logic. Oh. Okay, I'm vlogged.